Hey YouTube, it's Hair BMW. Uh, this is my uh, unshaven weekend attire, but I uh, thought I'd give you an update on uh, where I am with my new project, my 06 uh, 330i. So literally spent the entire weekend and um, sort of tried to give it an initial detail and try and figure out uh, what if anything was wrong or missing. I knew the car wasn't perfect, so thought I'd give you a tour around now and uh, just sort of let you see the before and the after although the before was in the garage and it was uh, pretty dark in a black car so I'm not sure how much of it showed up but anyway show you around it's um, it's all pretty much cleaned up really well um, didn't really find too much under here that I believe is a problem did find that the uh, this other stud was just sitting in there so that's my power steering so I'm gonna have to uh, rig that up so that it's uh, a bit more stable and um, the stud appears to be pressed in so it may mean new bracket rather than new um, new power steering pump but other than that um, I was pleasantly surprised to see that all the filters um, filters in here cabin filters uh, everything had been uh, had been replaced they were all brand new and I'd noticed that I'd had a problem with the washer fluid here and um, when I put washer fluid in it came running out right here and dripped over so clearly there's a problem with the canister I haven't gotten my new Bentley yet but it's fair to assume that the line goes down and comes in so the reservoir must be in here and um, it's either got a hole in it or there's a hose off or something not entirely sure but um, you know it's a black car and it's in pretty good shape I mentioned before um, not perfect didn't want a perfect car because my intention is to try and learn how to do color correction but uh, really what it needs right now more than anything is uh, a good coat of wax because it's got that dealer crap they put on it when they detail it while you're waiting to pick it up and uh, you know it's it's terrible but by and large car turned out pretty well and um, you know there's a there's a bunch of little issues I do need to uh, I wanted to uh, take the underhood mat off and all of these little fasteners are mommicked up and uh, I may just get new fasteners and then when I do that is take the take the mat off I may just get a whole new mat and uh, and fasteners I don't really know the interior I suspect that possibly what happened was when all of this carbon fiber trim was done by whoever did it I think they might have tried to do the whole center console and it clearly didn't work I took all this out this was all broken I was afraid it was completely broken but when I took it apart I was able to just put all the pieces back together and it and it works really well the ashtray works fine but you can see that this had an unbelievable uh, gunk sticky it's still up here you can scrape it with your fingernail um, it, it's just terrible so um, I'm fairly certain that the idea I'm gonna have to pursue is to just get a whole new console um, that's not gonna be cheap this bezel um, if I can find one of those in black I may start with that because really it's just the sides which are next to the bolsters of the seat which are the worst and you know I don't know we'll see um, but the interior is good I noticed that when the sunroof closes it doesn't bring the shade back I do have some grease spots there's one there there's one there where a garage door opener I think was which is odd because it's got the um, built-in garage door openers that you can program but both the sun visors are discolored 
um, you know, from use, hands, whatever. So um, I may try and clean them up. I may try and just replace them. I'll have to wait and see. But, you know, basically everything is, is in good shape. Um, here, actually on both sides, these uh, strips along here, uh, the, there's a little plastic rectangular receiver that goes in and uh, two of them are broken the other three are you know pretty badly messed up and uh, same sort of thing on the passenger side um, but but by and large really the car is in oops, sorry about that the car's in good shape the iDrive uh, works beautifully it's it's interesting that BMW offers something called car carbon fiber trim, which, as near as I can see on the internet, looks exactly like this does. So, uh, I don't think that this is a kit because this is a this is a soft uh, material. But I, I, the more I look at it, the more I think it was either professionally done or done really, really well. Um, and because there are a few places. You can see, well, it's kind of hard to see, but right here, there's a tail that's come loose. Same thing on the other side, but, you know, not, not really very bad at all. And uh, the other project that I undertook um, in hopes of repairing it was this uh, passenger side drink holder. And uh, what I sort of feared um, turned out to be the case. It, it was A, gunked up with all kinds of clearly soda or some sticky residue. Um, and what had happened was at some point somebody tried to shove it in and a bunch of the pieces were, were broken. And either at the same time or when somebody tried to fool with it, when you take this uh, garnish panel off, there's a screw right here. And as soon as I turned the screw, all of the plastic from the center of the receiver around all of it just fell out on the floor so um, somebody had had it out and had mommicked it up you know pretty badly and that's okay so I need to get a new one of these this one works just fine um, I took it out cleaned it put it all back together and, and it works just fine so and and I didn't realize it initially till I was looking for them but They've got a, a little fascia panel on them, and, and it's actually missing here, so. You know, the car's in good shape. It's a project, it's what I wanted. Much more convenient, um, and quite frankly, truth be told, with, with the exception of the roof being down, it's every bit as much fun to drive as that Z3 was. Um, this, is this has got a, uh, uh, oh, I, I don't have, uh, up in my desk, I have all the information, but it's got the, sport package and touring package and I don't know it's got a whole bunch of different things so uh, you know I've got uh, bits and pieces this is the uh, the piece that came off of the power steering see it's just sheared right off and they just set it back in and that's not atypical and it's trying to make my list of parts that I've got to pick up so uh, that's about it for now YouTube I'm gonna put this up and uh, Hopefully a day or so, and uh, again, as I want to do, uh, it is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful spring day in eastern North Carolina. Uh, we had a horrible winter, just absolutely horrible, and you can see the leaves are coming out, and the wind is just a nice little breeze, so in another week, we're going to be fully into spring and, and glad of it. So. Um, Hope it's getting better where, where everybody else is. I know it's probably still a little cold up in the north, but um, it's, it's getting good here. So that's it. Take care.